What is up, everybody? Rod J back again. Time to take a look at another beer. Thanks for swinging by to check out another video. Today, I'm going to check out another one from Wooding Cast Brewing out of Newport, Kentucky here. It is a look at their back center Imperial Stout. So this one comes in at an ABV of 11.1%. Looking forward to seeing what this one has to offer is aged in bourbon and rye barrels. Only two things I would say about on the label here, and I mentioned in another video, date and ABV are not on the bottle. Again, something that I think should be done for all of the uh, beers that you purchase out there. I think it uh, should be just automatic, but you know, it is what it is. That being said, they do some great beers, so looking forward to checking this one out. And to my friend Randy, who was the owner there, cheers, my friend. Nice look here on the beer. Nice dark color. Nice one finger, uh, dark brown. Yeah, well, I guess dark tannish kind of head. Nice aroma. Nice malts coming out. Pretty aromatic. You pick up the barreling on the nose. You definitely get a feel of the rye in there, and a little bit of a spice kick. But. Rather easy smelling, not picking up too much of the booziness, taste-wise. Pretty smooth, pretty smooth. Goes down real easy on the back end. Feel a nice feel of the beer in the throat area. Getting that sweetness coming out. You're getting a little bit of that vanilla, a little bit of the Bourbon play. I feel like you got more of the bourbon in the taste and more of the rye on the nose. You can really feel it lingering a little bit there in the throat area. Nice coating in the mouth as the beer went down. A little bit of a tongue prickling when you hold it there, so you have a little bit of that carbonation in play. Very dessert appeal to the beer itself. In the mouth, kind of like those caramelly type tones. Not getting too much of the woodiness, maybe a little bit there, but you are getting some of that bourbon type feel, that vanilla type feel. Definitely lingering nicely. Another one here that if you had a cigar, you could easily pair up as well. It's just a pretty smooth overall beer. Nice full body on it. Not picking up any of the thinness, any wooderiness, anything along those lines. Booziness is under control nicely. You're not feeling an over impact of that either. Well crafted, well balanced, easy to sit back and enjoy, have a conversation as I'm talking, got the flavor still kicking around. So yeah, overall back center, a nice Imperial Stout offer from Wedding Cask. Again, they're out of Newport, Kentucky. So here in the Cincinnati area, if you've had any of their beers, let me know by leaving a comment down below. But this one is actually pretty decent. As I mentioned, they do a lot of good beers, so definitely uh, want to check them out. I have another one that I'll be sharing from them as well, but uh, nice job. Thanks for uh, swinging by to check out this video. I look forward to catching up with you guys soon. Other beers you want me to check out, make sure you let me know as well. Feel free to leave a comment down below. Remember, there's always time. Get your beer on. Cheers, and catch the next uh, episode here if you want to see another video.